Have you ever watched a video online and thought the animation looked so good that it had to take weeks to make? Well, I just turned this boring picture I took on my phone into a professional looking anime scene. It took me less than 10 minutes, and all I did was click a few buttons using Domo AI. Here's exactly how it works, and what I honestly think about this tool. Step 1. Set up Domo AI. The first thing you need to know is that Domo AI runs in your browser. That means you don't need to download anything complicated or buy expensive animation software. You just open the website, sign up, and you're ready to go. When you create an account, you'll actually get some free credits, so you can test it out without paying right away. That's a good way to see if you like the results before committing to anything. Step 2. Upload your image. Once you're signed in, click on the Image to Video tab. The process starts with uploading your image. Just make sure the image is less than 10 megabytes in size. Let's use this photo as an example today. Step 3. Give a prompt. After uploading the image, you'll see a box where you can type a description of what is happening or what you want to happen in the video. This is called a prompt. For our example video, I might type something simple like a person walking through the forest. This helps the AI understand how to transform the image. You don't have to be a professional writer to make a good prompt. The clearer and more detailed you are, the better the results. Something else you can do is use one of the templates here. These are pre-written prompts that can turn your image into a looping animation. Add a hug, a kiss, a zoom in, and so on. For our forest example, I'll apply the crane up template. Step four, adjust details. Now you set some technical details. You can choose the duration of the generated video. I'll go for five seconds. You can also choose the aspect ratio. If you want it for YouTube, 16 by 9 landscape works best. If you're aiming for TikTok or Instagram Reels, you might go for 9 by 16 portrait. While you're here, you can also pick the model. I recommend one of the latest V 2.4 models. If you want super professional looking results, go for the advanced version. If you need something quickly, and if it's maybe just one clip you'll use as part of a wider video, you can go for the faster version. I'll go for advanced. Step 6. Generate the video. Before hitting generate, you can also choose to remove the watermark. That does cost credits, but if you want to use the video in a professional way, it's worth it. Once all that's set, you click generate and wait. The waiting time depends on the length of the video and the complexity of your prompt. Usually it's just a few minutes. And when it's done, you can play back your video and see an image of yourself or your subject turned into a video clip. Step 7. Turn your video into a cartoon. If you want to make your video look even more different or animated, here's another Domo AI feature that you need to check out. Click on the Video to Video tab. Upload your video here. Make sure it's less than 50 megabytes in size. The length should also be under 60 seconds. That might sound like a limitation, but most social media videos and clips that people want to stylize are already short. If you're thinking about posting to TikTok, YouTube Shorts, or Instagram Reels, this length is perfect. For our example, let's upload the forest video that we just made. In the prompt section, we can type in something like a detailed anime style, crane up shot in the forest with vibrant, warm colors. Click on Model, and you'll see different options that can change the style of your video into anime. Clay cartoons, toy bricks, storybook cartoons, and much more. I'll go for Detail Anime. Underneath, select the Duration and Aspect Ratio. There's also an option to enable Lip Sync if your video includes someone speaking. This is a clever feature because it makes the A, I-generated animation, move the mouth in sync with the words. Once you've selected the settings, go ahead and click on Generate. In just a few minutes, we have our video in a completely different anime style. This is pretty impressive considering we started with just a plain, boring image, and this whole process took almost no effort. You can also upscale the video to full HD or even 4K, although that uses extra credits. If I had to animate this image manually, I would need to draw each frame, 
or use complicated animation software. That could take days. With Domo AI, it was just upload, choose a style, and generate. In under 10 minutes, I had a finished video that looked like it came out of an anime series. That's a huge difference in workflow. Step 8. Explore more Domo AI tools and features. Another powerful Domo AI feature is called Move. With this, you can take a character image and animate it using your own video as a reference. For example, if you upload a drawing of a character and then upload a video of yourself dancing, the AI will animate the character so that it dances the same way you did. That opens up creative options for animators and artists who want to bring their drawings to life without doing frame-by-frame -frame animation. And, if you're interested in creating characters from scratch, Domo AI also has an image generator that can turn text into images. So if you want a brand new anime character, you can type a description like a futuristic samurai with neon armor, and the AI will generate it. Then, you could take that image and animate it using the other features. The ecosystem is pretty complete for both casual users and creative professionals. My review of Domo AI now. Let's be honest and talk about how Domo AI compares to other tools. There are other AI video stylization tools out there. Some of them are built into apps like TikTok filters or Snapchat lenses. The difference is that those filters are usually simple overlays. They might give you a cartoon effect, but it still looks very filter-like and sometimes cheap. Domo AI goes deeper by actually redrawing frames to match a chosen art style, which makes the result more polished. There are also other web tools like Pika Labs or Runway that can do video generation, but many of those focus more on text to video rather than transforming existing videos. For people who just want to stylize a video they already shot, Domo AI is much more direct and beginner friendly. Of course, no AI tool is perfect. Sometimes the results can be a little inconsistent, especially if the video has a lot of fast motion or complicated backgrounds. Faces can sometimes look a little off in certain styles. The key is to experiment with different prompts and choose videos that are stable. Short clips with clear subjects usually look the best. That's why I recommend starting with simple actions like walking, talking, or sitting. You can always get more creative once you see how the AI handles things. So, should you use Domo AI over the alternatives? If your main goal is to quickly turn real videos into cartoon or anime style, yes. It's the best option right now. It's easy, it's fast, and the results are incredible. What do you think about Domo AI? Try it out for free, and let me know your thoughts in the comments below. While you're there, don't forget to like and subscribe for more videos like this.